so many good things to talk about from this game. I'm not sure where to start, but let's start with you. Congratulations on the win. Congratulations on the shutout. I know that's always a special moment, especially when it's your first one with a new team. Yeah, that's great. Um, but it also tells uh, tells a lot about uh, you know uh, uh, about the way we we played as a team tonight. Um, huge huge blocks, huge uh, uh, kills. Um, you know, good sticks on the PK and, and taking away seams and, and, and you know, um, boxing out guys so I could see uh, see pucks. So uh, huge thanks to the, to the guys in front of me. What also says how well you played tonight, Capo. You get that early goal by the Sharks and then you make a couple of huge stops early in that first period. Did those two things in combination give you the confidence throughout the course of this game? Yeah, for sure. Obviously, uh, during a the game, there's, uh, there's times, uh, you know, we get uh, big goals, timely goals. And and uh the other way you know we don't we don't give up a goal that's uh that's huge it uh, it eats their uh their momentum and you know they they don't really uh get going and we obviously get energy from that so uh so i think uh, it was uh, it was great today Capo, we i think sometimes assume that it's easy to just after a trade transition get used to a new place you came from a certain structure in minnesota came last year completely different coaching staff than you have now kind of like starting all over again this year for you at training camp what has that adjustment been like for you yeah for sure it's an adjustment every time uh you know there's a new coach um or a new coaching staff um and also a new goalie coach um you know we're still obviously fi uh finding that uh trying to you know get to know each other everyone uh in the team and and um me personally with uh with the coaches uh so you know trying to find that uh chemistry and that uh the, the way to uh kind of work uh daily and um but it's going to uh good direction I think uh, we're going step by step and um, it's obviously great to uh, get some uh, results as well well a big step for you and the team tonight we're so happy for you Capo and uh, thanks again for doing this with us thank you Capo Kakin and a 28 save shutout out yeah. for the San Jose Sharks his first in Teal and his first in well over a year with the Minnesota Wild and we do take for granted different players at different positions and different people adjust to movement and change at different paces and goalies are a, they're an odd breed sometimes it takes them a little while to get comfortable and get settled into a new environment yeah I, I think you know he's a quiet individual but he's also a guy that never has any highs and lows just seeing him around the team it's it's been uh, neat to get to know him where he doesn't get too high after a night like maybe tonight or doesn't get too low so that helps him he's going to help him moving forward in his professional career but he did mention the penalty kill tonight you look at the five on three opportunity that they had the, the Montreal Canadiens had at the start of the third period and this number one peak K unit comes out with an incredible kill shot blocking tonight with some you know Benino Benning all those guys making uh, individual efforts on the kill was phenomenal tonight that was a fun one here in Montreal we'll look forward to being right back with you from Toronto tomorrow guys